everyone, it's Johnsy from the MMPS Employee Wellness Center and today I have a 10 minute core workout for you. Um, this is how it's gonna work. So we are going to do a total of three sets. Each exercise is 30 seconds. We're gonna do six exercises and then take a 30 second break. So six exercises, 30 second break, repeat two more times. I'm gonna show you the first set and then you can rewind the video or just do it on your own for the next two sets. You won't need any equipment for today's workout. Just find a carpeted area of your house or grab some towels or a yoga mat to uh, lay down on the ground to protect your spine and your shoulder blades from that impact on the hard floor. At the end of this video, I'm gonna show some modifications. I will say that not all these exercises are beginner level. So if you have any difficulty with anything, be sure to stay tuned to the end of this video and I'm gonna show you some modifications to make all these exercises work for you. Great job. Now take a 30 second break and you will repeat that whole cycle two more times. If you need to take a longer break in between exercises or at the end, that's totally fine. But the great thing about going from exercise to exercise is it keeps your heart rate up for that little cardio burn. 
If you'd like some modifications for any of these exercises, stay tuned. Those are coming up next. So anytime we're in plank position with our feet outstretched, we want to make sure our shoulders, hips, and ankles are in line. So we should be in one straight line. If that's difficult for you to do with proper form, just bring your knees down. We'll start there. So you can keep your feet up like this, keep your feet down. Um, our plank touches will look like this. Our elbows to hands will look like this. Our modification for flutter kicks will look like this. So still lie flat, place your hands under your bottom, bring your shoulder blades up off the ground, but instead of keeping your legs close to the ground, you can increase your flutter range a little bit more. It won't be quite so much work on your abs. If you're not ready for full V-ups, we're gonna modify just like this. We'll place our hands right behind our bottom and bend our knees. And so knees will come in and then out. They should hover above the ground just a few inches in and out. So you do that for 30 seconds in lieu of doing full V-ups. Thanks so much for watching. Stay active and stay well.